This is the bathroom model afterwards. See, we expanded the shower, made it quite bigger, added up a nice bench. Added soap, dispensers in the wall with mosaic tiles, mosaic borders, dual in the shower. We have a water sense Kohler faucet along with a handheld shower unit. Then we replaced the whole tub deck with a freestanding tub and a Kohler antique faucet another with a handheld as well. We did a subway tiles with a brick lay pattern with glass mosaics across the top capped with a chair rail. We have a Kohler Cimarron water sense toilet, water efficient toilet. Coming back here, instead of doing the frame glass, we did a frameless shower door. Since this door is close to this one, we actually did a double pivot so you can open it either out, step in, or the shower door opens, opens inside too. We replaced the old track light with a new one. And then added a new vanity with vessel sinks and tall faucets. It's the spa style vanity with the towel holder in between. Soft closed drawers. And then double mirrors that match along with new light fixtures. Then we also added the Panasonic Whisper Green exhaust vent. That vent runs for a preset time pivot on, upon motion, so you enter, you can set it for 10 minutes to go off afterwards, and you can change the CFMs to it, whatever you would like, there's custom settings. And it operates completely quiet. And then underneath the tiles, we added a radiant floor heating mat, and there's the control for that so that you can turn on the floor and it will heat up and make the tiles warm. Mosaic bath tiles in the shower.